Well, maybe the last Sunday with Jacob Zuma on the front cover of a newspaper. Because today is something very special. I don't know if you recognize this picture here. This picture happened 28 years ago. 28 years ago, on the 11th of February 1990, when Nelson Khodiklakla Mandela walked out of the Victor Verstappen prison and went on to the steps of the city hall and made his speech. And there he is, and there's the young Cyril Ramaphosa holding up the microphone. And that's what we should be celebrating today. Yes, 28 years ago, we have still have got the excitement of knowing that we are on the right track. Oh, I'll never forget that day. I was in my in my embassy in Babiti Kosweti, and of course, uh, Cookie, my maid, uh, and my domestic supervisor, um, sweet, wonderful Cookie, who of course then became an MP after 1994, uh, said I must come and watch on the TV set in the kitchen because our color set was broken. And there I sat and I said, what am I looking at? They said, Victor for stair prison, madam. I said, oh, it's Nelson Mandela. He's walking to freedom. There he is. They said, no, 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 that's the garden boy. And I said, Dara said, no, 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 that's the Reverend Jesse Jackson. I said, oh, it's all the blacks look alike. And everybody laughed. And then somebody said, I think it was Cookie. She said, don't worry, madam. When Winnie Mandela walks out of the Victor Sear prison, the man whose hand she's holding will be Nelson Mandela. I said, not necessarily, Cookie. And there, there he was. There he was. Suddenly it was so obvious, this tall, elegant man just walking as if he was walking through a rose garden. Oh my goodness, where would we have been today if Nelson Mandela had come out of jail angry? Huh? I mean, how would you have felt in jail for 27 years for what you believe in, away from your children, your wife goes mad? Hmm? Nelson Mandela so easily could have come out of jail and spoken like Robert Mugabe. Nelson Mandela could have said, to hell with democracy, take the farms and kill the whites. And yeah, hundreds upon hundreds of whites could have been killed and nobody in the world or on CNN would have looked in our direction. But he didn't say that. He came out of jail with a smile. He came out of 27 years of darkness and gave us light. <laughs> and ESCOM gave up. What am I saying here? I'm saying here, back to the future. Of course, things are happening today that are upsetting. But 28 years ago, somebody opened the door and everything changed. And let us also thank him. Where we would have been today, where would we have been today if F.W. de Klerk had not opened that door? I don't have an answer to that question, except to say maybe we would have had more water. Viva Nelson Mandela! Viva! Evita, Evita, and you know what we mean. Evita, Evita, always on the scene. Evita, Poseidon, oh, Evita should be queen. <laughs>